He's had enough. That being Niji Sanji English's Luka Kaneshiro, self-described as an evil and mean mafia boss, and expressing his displeasure here on stream. Yeah, I mean, th there are certain things that make people's blood boil like that. Is there anything that comes to mind you really don't like? Oh, when people talk the, you know, the company we work for. I don't like that. There you go. There you go. I'm gonna say it. Makes my blood boil. I get it. Some people are mad at some things, but man, it doesn't make us feel better too. Are you kidding me? He motivates us. Like obviously, like we've we've voiced out our own problems as well, right? I think everyone has. You know, like hey, blah blah blah. You know, all that stuff. Not being invited to some things. Yeah, like some people. Yeah, that things like that happen. <laughs> it's fine. Things like that happen. It's literally normal. I've had my fair share thing, uh, fair, fair share of things like off stream as well. You know that I have problems with, but yeah, I can be mad at it. I can be upset about it. In reality, is it really bad? No. Would I would I prefer to you know like like not stream anymore? Quit quit doing this? Absolutely not. And work like a different job, like an office job or something like that. Cause chat, you know, I almost became an engineer. And I would definitely not choose this, like, choose that over this. Every workplace has its bad stuff. You know, I've worked at Subway, I've worked as a waiter, worked all s sorts of jobs. It is not, nothing compares. Nothing compares. Nothing compares. Like, we, you know, I sign a contract that dictates everything I'm supposed to do, not do. I cannot be mad at that. I signed it. I signed it. That's all I have to say about it. Drama happens, sometimes you can't really escape that. People spread false information and for some reason, fans would rather listen to those type of people than the actual livers themselves. That being said, I'm having fun, I'm chilling. I look forward to things daily. It's comfortable. Uh, best to ignore them. Yeah, you're right. You're right, you're right. But you know, even us livers have a breaking point. We just want to make people happy. Luka Kaneshiro being a part of the Luxium wave of Niji Sanji English. This wave currently in not one, but two exclusive collaborations. Niji Sanji taking to Billy Billy to announce this one, a theme shop in Shanghai running until the end of this week. All while Luxium is taking part in this fancy frontier collaboration, having a live panel at the Taipei Expo Dome this Sunday on October 15th. Niji Sanji's parent company, Any Color, once again releasing further financial reports now employing over 300 staff members not including their talents which number into the triple digits niji sanji the company itself being valued at 2.5 billion us dollars this time last year with their ceo garnering a net worth of 1.1 billion us dollars as of last year some of those earnings due in part to the extensive merchandising done for every single niji sanji talent that merchandise ranging from goods and voice patterns such as the release of these Niji Sanji Halloween 2023 goods, which for some reason or another was spelled with two H's at the top of this graphic, alongside recently criticized merchandise releases, such as these white t-shirts with default artwork selling for over 36 US dollars. Niji Sanji also experiencing problems with bootleg merchandise, including a fake Niji Sanji English store. Once registered to nijisanjienstore.com, and portraying themselves as an official Niji Sanji shop website. That is next, we turn to Niji Sanji Indonesia talent Reza Avanluna, having now graduated from the company, giving us this farewells release of full album containing most, if not all, of his original songs. In addition, this Niji Sanji liver would write a farewell message in three different languages, saying the skills I acquired, the knowledge I understood, the trials and errors I made, and the experience I gained are all all the ones that define this thing that can only be described as a long fever dream. Saying, unfortunately, with the changing times, everything grew. What I found and want to pursue now don't necessarily fit with what I wanted to before. Saying further, I will keep this memory in the safest place in my heart and hope that I'll still remember how it will feel in the future. As also set to graduate from Niji Sanji is Indonesia talent, Iona. This Panther medic tweeting out this morning on Wednesday, October 18th, I will be closing my Maro, which means that
that after the 18th, you won't be able to send any messages to my inbox anymore. If there's anything you've been meaning to send, please do so before then. During Reza's graduation, Hiona tweeting out, words will never be concise enough, deep enough to describe how proud we are of you. And also tweeting out, stand on these nuts. This talent set to graduate later this month. The Nijisanji Indonesia roster originally having 19 members. With the graduation of Hiona, that will bring it down to 10 remaining. That now bringing us over to the Virtual Talent Academy, an effort ran by Nijisanji's parent company, AnyColor, to train future VTubers, many of which could become future Nijisanji livers. The VTA abruptly suspending their activities, this time three months ago, and then two months ago, revealing that that was due to multiple breaches of contracts with their students. The Virtual Talent Academy now returning with an update, now announcing that activities will resume, and stating under the new program, only some of the current students will be able to stream on the official VTA YouTube channel. In addition, we have removed the current students list due to the operation under this new program. As just before the suspension of activities, they had a brand new fourth class introduced, bringing the total number of students in the VTA to over two dozen. But now after activities have resumed, only three of these students remain, and with no further students being made public at this time. Returning back to Nijisanji English, we have Pomo Rainpuff saying, Today I become sentient like Pinocchio and learn how to emote. Pomo receiving a 3.0 brush up and saying, I hope you like all the expressions. Pomo this week also sharing, got some disappointing news today. Overall, it has been a pretty gloomy day for me. I hope your day was much better. Sometimes I get worried that on the outside, it looks like I'm not doing much, but I'm working on planning things. But when those things fall through or get rejected, it's just more time that I'll need to plan for something else and becoming more looking like I'm doing nothing. Thank you for all your encouragement. I know these things happen and I don't let them stop me from planning things in general. I think on top of feeling icky today and the news, I was just feeling a little down. I'll feel better tomorrow. Pomo earlier sharing, I was going through my closet and found a treasure trove. Seen here sharing her saved Pokemon games from years before and receiving this response, OMG, those exist in real life. I've never seen one. That comment coming by way of Patrick Gurren, your neighborhood penguin. This penguin VTuber accurately cosplayed here alongside another costume play of Nijisanji Japan's Oliver Evans. Patrick Gurren releasing more members-only wallpapers and saying, I'm in your phone, while also being a part of Niji Bear Volume 1. Nijisanji Engel saying, get comfy with adorable Nijisanji and Nijisanji EN liver-themed teddy bears and merchandise. These bears and merchandise set to become available early next week as also early next week, celebrating her birthday will be Nijisanji English's Alira Pandora. This solar sky dragon saying, my birthday is almost here. This year, there's going to be a countdown stream with a new outfit reveal. I'd love to see your predictions with the birthday hashtag being Alira got cake 2023 and the outfit tag being hashtag peep the fit. Nijisanji, of course, announcing the prerequisite birthday good set as having also celebrated her birthday was one of the original Nijisanji members, that being Sokino Mito, congratulating herself here and receiving congratulations not just from Luka Kaneshiro, but also from fans broadcasting their wishes to her in Shinjuku, Tokyo. Mito's birthday stream being attended by not just IRL talents and also other Nijisanji talents, but also talents well outside of Nijisanji, including Hall of Japan's Usada Pakora. This all while Mito once again voiced her displeasure with her 3D model, loving the design except for for this part, wherein she had discovered on the bottom of her shoes there had been placed Niji Sanji logos. And speaking of Niji Sanji birthdays, we also have Rosami Lovelock at the time of her birthday releasing a brand new cover of Kyofu All Back and another Niji EN birthday coming by way of Aster Arcadia releasing a cover of Last Stardust. One of the most surprising song releases recently from Niji Sanji English was by Selene Tatsuki claiming herself to be the gremlin of EN. And this past week and releasing the Fly High music video, stating after a year the wait is finally over, my first original song is going to premiere. The music video is beautiful and I can't wait to finally show it. As also showing off is Aya Amare of Nijisanji English. This time last month sharing ran out of milk, but I'm too tired to go out and buy more, so I just ate cereal with water. And being next in line for a 3.0 brush up. Herself and Nijisanji Indonesia talent Layla almost looking like sisters here. Aya afterwards saying thanks for tuning 
tuning into my 3.0 debut. I hope you liked it. As this week, Aya, along with other members of her wave, Aluna, took part in an off collab with one another. Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> That getting the attention of Niji Sanji English's Inna Alouette, making this masterpiece her profile picture, and getting in on that off collab voice tweet action. Hello! Hello. Hello. Yeah, I'm just kidding. I'm by myself. And uh, earlier saying F you to herself for not giving her the copyright to her original song, receiving this demonetization from YouTube. As also releasing an original song was Niji Sanji English's Finana Ryugu, saying stream on say so, stream on say so. Thank you everyone for showing a lot of love and positivity towards my new original song, leading to Nanalis on their safe for work account, sharing I had the huge opportunity to illustrate Finana on her new original song on Say So. Make sure to check it out as she did so great. Thank you so much. As Finana later would share, if anyone ever feels like giving up or has imposter syndrome, I came here with barely any experience at the start. But looking now, I realize I've learned and done so much. It was challenging and mentally draining, but I'm proud to still be here. You can do it. Don't give up. One of those streams being alongside Niji Sanji English's Sunny Briscoe, as both the Lazo Light and Noctix Wave had received brand new Palverse figures. And speaking of Sunny merch, we now have evidence he's still taller even when sitting. That being taller than Niji Sanji English's Millie Parfait. Self-described now as a sexy witch of calamity and alongside other members of Etheria celebrating two years with Niji Sanji. Having earlier collabed on a cover song alongside Maria Marionette and then releasing her second original song, Magic is All Around. Sharing free high quality wallpapers for the second year anniversary. Thank you guys for your support. I am not poor anymore because of you guys. I can even eat Jollibee without thinking about how much I can eat. Thank you. Please accept my love. Millie Parfait also sharing her second anniversary merchandise, saying this has been planned for the longest time and I'm so happy that we finally get an official towel robe. Shout out to Stafsan who went all out designing the cute robe. It was very practical during cold winters and sweaty summer cons. I hope you like it. Millie confirming the members of the Etheria had a hand in designing their own merchandise for their second anniversary, but also now coming to us with this notice of termination, writing, I am terminating the hat. No more hats. Hat emoji will be removed. This being signed by Millie. That backlash coming after a hat only stream. Millie Parfait saying hat gorilla stream. It's just the hat. And yes, the stream was simply just the hat. Leading to viewers to absolutely drown this stream in super chats. Millie being very clear that she was not happy seeing her followers called the hat their Kami Oshi. This hat now also being a free model available for any VTuber available from Scuffword. As now also with Niji Sanji, we turn to Mika Malatika. Turning heads with this tweet saying, I love BBC, British boyfriend cuddles. That being a punishment tweet as part of a charity stream that lasted for over 60 hours. Viewers racking up over $41,000 earned to support child welfare in Indonesia. After Mika saying, this has been the best 60 hours of my life and I owe it all to you. For all the support, whether it's spending some time, spreading the word, or donating, you guys did it. This will be a memory that I will keep very dear to my heart. Thank you. Mika later going on to release an original song entitled Message Delivered from the Departed. Hall Live Indonesia's Ayundu Risu saying, gonna put this song on repeat because it's cool AF. As earlier this week, we also had the release of this Mika Dakimakura art. Mika here saying, saying, fill me up, and it's free, two sides available, and giving us this Google Drive link. That a while earlier, Mika was slaying hearts, having won the most recent RPR RizzaTuber session with Camila. Mika responding to that result with, believe it. And now turning back to Niji Sanji Japan, we have Kanai. Advertisements this week running in Shinjuku for his first concert live Blu-ray, and teaming up with YouTube Japan. Kanai here seen showing off his brand new outfit, and of course recently streaming along alongside his good friend, Kuzaha. The two of them recently being a part of the insanely popular VCR Arc server, leading to Kuzaha to be the most watched VTuber in the first week of October, along with Kanai.
I landing in seventh place. All while Kuzaha is rocking this brand new outfit. And also rocking it is our co-host Lady, bringing us even more things VTubers say. Thanks, False. British metal and wear Neko, OB Katie Cat, releases a new cover, This Is Exile, now available on all platforms. That will also teasing their latest collaboration with Anumi Music, that is in their upcoming song Lost, coming October 14th. And speaking of music, it's Bow the Whale, who releases their promo for their new music cover, Girls Like Me Don't Cry. That while Bow is also showcased in this adorable figurine, handmade by Wanyu, crime boss gang leader Ellie has finally showcased all their forms, posting, I hope you like my new outfits and lore, thank you for making me the luckiest boss in the world. With all these new designs shown here, illustrated by Rikito, with this big heist debuting these three new looks being a casino dress, bunny outfit, and the heist outfit. Goblin Druid VTuber Appleseed is hosting nominations for the Shitty Small VTuber Award, with multiple categories such as the most scuffed and meme lore supreme, asking you who in this community deserves the titles. Milky holds an official funeral for their practice model, as they are currently undergoing preparations for their new model and upcoming debut, reintroducing themselves to the now new recruits to the Milk Militia, as Milky so humbly announces that they are Major Milky, and are very excited to debut their full look this upcoming October 15th, already showcasing that they're not named Milky for nothing. Definitely not an alien, Spongy debuts a brand new look, with the new model designed and created by Click Draws. Spongy would also like to thank everyone so much for over 5,000 followers, though that's not all they would be receiving as Moopy Buns would dedicate this song to their besties debut. Celestial Phoenix Aurora has unfortunately come across a spider, but upon having to exterminate said spider, their little babies ended up crawling all over the place. Honestly, I think I would just move at that point. Though in happier news, Aurora excitedly announces that they are now partnered with Kick as their first signed VTuber. Thanking everyone so much for the support, Aurora posts, I'm honored to help represent VTubers on the platform. Let's make the Kick VTuber community an awesome place. D&D VTuber Melissa Belladonna has currently been hosting an uncapped subathon for over 70 days now, hoping for the timer to end soon. So that's not all, as this tiefling would also announce some new merchandise, from t-shirts to stickers and even your very own tail. Crane VTuber Asuru celebrates their first anniversary with a full model reveal, having now finally debuted, posting thank you everyone who made the event happen. That as Azuru would also release a cover song together with me. Radioactive VTuber Vividly ASMR showcases their very four distinctive forms. That while celebrating three years since their first Switch stream, and also showcasing a more compact Vivi with just as much radiation. Cute and cursed Goblin Podge announces a sneak peek for their 4.0 model, and mascot Gary hoping to come to a Twitch stream near you on October 31st. That's not all they plan to debut, announcing a teaser for their very first original song, Monster. The perfect jam to listen to on a Halloween night. And now back to you, False. Thank you again, lady. Our co-host currently running her very own subathon on Twitch.tv. Check it out with the link below. And receiving brand new artwork, including this piece from Inyur, saying a little warm-up doodle of my favorite news lady. Her office lady outfit is very charming. Alongside relaxed entity giving us this piece for Inktober. Even adding a very special Easter egg on that laptop. And stay tuned for our next episode, wherein perhaps we'll find out more about this cockroach woman that V Shoujo has been teasing this week. V Shoujo at the time of this recording, dropping another debut announcement. Introducing the newest member of V Shoujo appearing in her first Twitch television debut. That television showing a very familiar background. And then a bug like hand reaching out and grabbing a glass of wine. Giving us a new Twitch.tv address along with the debut date of Sunday, October 15th at 3.30 Pacific, 6.30 Eastern. And leading to this new account of the world's most resilient VTuber saying hello, you can bug me anytime. Telling Iron Mouse to do her taxes along with and I will always keep bugging you until the ends of time. And that is all for this episode. As always, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe below. Send in your VTuber news to our Discord and we'll have more things VTubers say for you soon. 
British metal coffee. Oh, coffee. Coffee. Green tea. Coffee. Restart. I'll just pause the video. Restart. In their upcoming song, I'm so terribly lost. Restart. <laughs> I think it's just lost. No, I'm so... Anyway, restart. <laughs> restart. Aurora excitedly announces that they are officially partnered with Quick. Quick. Did you know that they're officially partnered with Quick? Sorry. Restart.